metal generates heat due to electromagnetic induction because of two main effects, dual heating and magnetic hysteresis. Dual heating is the result of electric currents flowing through the resistance of the metal. When a metal is subjected to an alternating electromagnetic field, it induces eddy currents within the metal. These currents are circular and flow in planes perpendicular to the magnetic field. The eddy currents encounter the resistance of the metal, which causes them to dissipate power in the form of heat. If you like my video, please like and follow my channel. Magnetic hysteresis is the result of the alignment of the magnetic domains of the metal. When a metal is subjected to an alternating electromagnetic field, it causes the magnetic domains of the metal to switch their orientation repeatedly. This switching process involves some energy loss, which is also dissipated as heat. Magnetic hysteresis is more significant in ferromagnetic and ferromagnetic materials, such as iron, than in other metals. The amount of heat generated by electromagnetic induction depends on several factors, such as the frequency and strength of the electromagnetic field, the electrical conductivity and magnetic permeability of the metal, the shape and size of the metal, and the coupling between the metal and the inductor. To learn more about induction heating applications please watch my other videos.